Make sure shout out to my amazing members and patrons Sam Medina, Matthew Hall, Lucky Charms, Rick Hemingway, Charlene Kelly, I Am Beast, Madlo, Yumi, Harrington, Justin Rice, Jelly Beams, Mephisto, MDS 84ZA, Kanye 76, UK's Reaper, Krebian, Balalco, and Killabunny 264 for your amazing support. Hey everyone, and welcome back to Rebirth Mod. So, last episode, for those who didn't catch it, was insane. Uh, I wonder if I do this and wait, this in comma. Hold. Oh, they come to me. Okay, cool, 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 cool. So if you hold shift and comma, you have to hold down shift. So let's just do this, for example. See, they're not attacking this dude, but if I hold uh, dot again. Hunting. That's hunting. Okay, that and comma. Resume. Okay, so I hold down shift and then press comma. That makes them attack the zombies. Do the same. Oh, no, that makes them stop attacking the zombies. Do the same and then they attack. And then with the uh, the full stop, it allows them to hunt animals and stuff. That's really cool. That is amazing. There are other tricks as well to have them teleport to you and stuff, but I already forgot what the commands were. Um, let's go this way and up to see if we can't find a desert. We need to hurry though, because it needs to be before dark. I can't afford to do this during daytime. Oh, during nighttime, I mean. Already during daytime, you see all of these bosses and stuff just all over. Now imagine we go into the desert, which is a little bit tougher than this one. Ooh, there might even be NPCs with guns in the desert, so we have to be careful. It's a shame I can't hire an NPC yet for some reason. I'm guessing it's to do with the fact that I have to inject myself with the charisma thing. Uh, but yeah, we'll, we'll test that stuff out when we get back to the base. First off, I need this chem station. That's a kamikaze. I think that uh, shrilling sound is a kamikaze that's uh, making its noise. Okay, yeah, so we just have to find a desert right now. I think I... I'm just going to drive as much as I can, cut out as much as I can, because I don't want to just be talking over me just driving. That's boring. So if something happens, like we have to fight a boss or something, or something new and interesting happens, I'll get you guys back. Until then, I'm going to waste all my fuel looking for this desert. I just realized we don't have enough fuel. If the desert isn't up here, we might have to come back to this town and look for some trucks. That's the only way we're going to get some fuel. You know, yeah, on the way through here, because we only have like 150 um, gas left, so as we pass through here, every single truck I see, bus, truck, whatever, I'm going to try and wrench as well, just to make sure that we get as much fuel as possible. We don't want to run out of fuel in the middle of nowhere. Oh, that's a bandit. <laughs> don't you dare attack my panthers, let them attack you. There you go. So they can handle their thing while I do this. Yes, yeah, since I looted it, we actually got some... Ooh, another one. We actually got some fuel by looting it. That means we should be able to get some fuel by actually arranging it as well. There you go. Probably tell them to halt because the one's already starting to die. But I think they heal themselves after a while anyways. Uh, if you guys actually need to make this explode, I'm going to be so mad. It looked like I wanted to get through this thing just now. Did I just get fuel from that? I don't think so. I definitely, when I looted it, got fuel, but I don't know if I got any when I just did that. Okay, so technically I should hold them for now. We don't want them running off while I'm busy ranging vehicles, because then they're going to die before I realize what's going on. Please tell me the, far, the desert is over here somewhere. I should have probably checked out the map before starting my gameplay. That NPC over there I really want to hire, but unfortunately my charisma is not high enough. If I can get my charisma level higher, we can hire that dude with a gun. And it sounds like he has an AK, so it's a really good gun to actually have. Ooh, fuel. Um, I don't think there's going to be any fuel inside of this. But there might be. Yep, inside of here. Yeah, there you go. Thank you. Maybe be careful, because it might be able to... Wait, how do you teleport them to you again? There's a shift something, I believe. I can't remember what the command is. I think if you pick them up and you put them down again. Yeah, let's do that. Um, well, how do you pick them up? Follow me. Stay where you're standing. Stay where I'm standing. Come with me. Change my name. Uh, Yeah, someone said if you can pick them up and place them down again, they heal themselves. Unless it's just with the teleport thing. I can't remember what the teleport command is, though. That's a problem. I should be able to use a health kit on the, the panther, but I don't want to waste all my health kits now. I mean, now the problem's going to be, where is this desert? Uh, let's just go north as far as possible and then just see if we can't get lucky. 
Unfortunately, if I see a vehicle now, I won't even be able to loot it because this bear is going to follow us forever. Yep, see, it's following us. I could wrench this vehicle over here and this one over here. These buses have fuel. And then these trucks over here. That's why I say buses and trucks. Okay, as long as you guys are standing still, that is awesome. So yeah, let me just quickly do this. I'm going to try and see if we can't find the forest. Oh, you know what we could do? If I had enough frames, we could actually stack up and see if we can't see the, the desert from a distance. And my dogs are insanely loud today. Even the neighbors are actually shouting at the dogs to shut up. <laughs> okay, so let's try not... Ooh, is it a bandit? No, it can't be. Yeah, Emily. Hello, Emily. Uh, let's try to not waste any more fuel. I'm going to hold comma. Alt. Alt. Yeah, there you go. And then we need to stack up on the roof of here and see if we can't find the desert. So I'm just going to do this quickly. Basically, I'm hoping that we can stack higher than the trees right now. Oh, please don't teleport up to me and then die. And be careful, the panthers might actually... Yep. Oh, crap. I swear, if they jump to their deaths right now, it seems like they can actually uh, make the landing without taking too much damage. No! 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 You bloody... Okay, John, just calm down. Just calm down. That is massively BS. But okay. Um... I'm going to have to tell them to stay where they're standing. There we are standing. No, where did you just go? No, 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 no. Don't do that to me. Oh, crap. I won't be able to do that. Now I have to get my frames back somehow. I think that uh, that uh, panther is on the inside. I'm going to have to go inside just to save my panther right now. It's so messed up right now. I have to get inside because the panthers... I think it uh, spawns through the floor just now. Okay, there you go. I want to see if I can't shoot him before he woke up just now. That is so bad. That's such bad luck, guys. Now my panther might be... I'm just hoping it is inside somewhere because it just teleported through the roof. We already lost a panther last time, although it doesn't say in chat that it's died. Yes, you know what? Yes, now we can make a... Yeah, 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 yeah. We don't have to get, uh, get the... Um... Now, where's my bloody panther? I think I just wasted a panther. But yeah, we don't have to get the oil shale now. Okay, uh, come on. Attack, 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 attack. I can't attack them when their heads are stuck inside the zombies. Bloody hell. Halt. Come on, come to me, come to me, come to me. Resume. Resume. I need to be able to see their heads to be able to help them. But if their heads are stuck inside the panthers, I can't do any headshots. And only headshots count, so it's a little bit tough thing for me. I'm gonna lose my panthers. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, stamina. I need to drink some coffee quickly. Something just went up. I don't know what went up, but something just went up. Can't still. Ooh, the egg spike. Okay, now where the hell's my other panther? It's either inside the roof somewhere. Guys, I just lost a uh, complete, a whole panther. It has to be in the roof of here if I teleport it down from me telling it to stay. Um, how do I tell them to just stop without them despawning on me? There you were standing. No! Why does that get rid of them? Am I praying? Stay where you're standing. Why am I losing my panthers? I have no... I, I don't get this. 
I just lost Panther. I need to get up as high as possible to see where I am. But I can't do that. Because every time I go up high like that, the Panthers jump up over me. That's why I broke my leg just now. I thought the Panther might be in the roof because it went through the floor just now. But it completely despawned on me. I think there might be a bug with the Panthers, if I'm not mistaken. Because this is, this is really messed up. I spent 900 per Panther and I only have one left. Now I'm scared to tell this one to stay where you are because the other two just disappeared on me. It doesn't seem like they went into the roof, so I just lost two Panthers. The fact that they jump up... Uh, I, I wish when you're jumping up, like going up, they stand still. They don't move at all. Okay, so we have a container up there quickly. How long is my leg going to be? I need to probably heal as well because this is going to be messed up. Okay, at least we have some fuel. Did it give any notification of like they died or something? I didn't see anything, right? So our panthers should be somewhere. Just where is the question? Did they TP back to the base? Ooh, sporadic speed. I wonder if they TP'd back to the base. Where did they go? I told them to stay where they're standing so they have to stay where they're standing. I don't see any panthers in the roof or by me, so we definitely lost them just now. If you guys know what happened to them, please comment down below. That's the second time now I've lost panthers for telling them to stay where they are. Okay, let's just do this so I remember where this was. Because just now we can get the panthers back over here, although I doubt it. It doesn't seem like the desert's going to be up to your north. I really needed the oil. Oh no, you know what? Now we don't need the oil shale, but I still want to complete this quest anyways. Because now that we have a, a broken chem station or repairable one, we can just make our own. We don't need the recipe now. Okay, so I went all the way north and was like, yeah, the desert shouldn't, it, it can't be up there. It's almost to the finish line. Over here, it shows that the wasteland's busy going up. So the forest or the, the desert has to be on this side of here there. So we're going to go down there. But on the way back, I just, I stopped at this gas station again, just to see if you can't see the Panthers. Unfortunately, they're not here. I'm going to tell this dude to stay oh. out of this. Uh, underneath the trader is this thing over here. Oh, not a uh, trader. Underneath this gas station. See, I, it's halting, but it's still following me. I don't want it to follow me, but I can't tell it to stay where it's standing because then I lose my third panther. Okay, can I do this? Thug. Seems it's only a thug. Hopefully it's not like a badass thug or something. The room at the back, that's going to be the tough one if I'm not careful. Usually the tougher zombies on the back of here. It's just a shame that we can't get our frames back. If I try and do it again, I'm going to break my legs again. Another zombie in there. Hey, what? I could have sworn there was another zombie just now. It made, it made another noise. Okay, guys, I am so dejected right now from losing those panthers. I finally got the panthers back. Well, we lost one and then we bought three and now we lost two again. It's so easy, it seems, to just lose your companions. I'm actually thinking of spawning them back in because that's not... They didn't die. I didn't let them go or something. It's just They just despawned. So if they're not... I think it's fair. I don't know about you guys, but I, I'm going to do it. Um, Since they didn't die in battle... And so, uh, if they're not at the base, like they went back to the base just now, I'm going to spawn them back in. It's, it's unfair to lose companions just because you tell them to halt, to stand where they're standing. But from now on, I'm going to definitely have to use the commands to uh, take control of them, because it seems if you tell them in the chat menu, you lose them. And I don't want to lose anymore. And I think let's go to the base first and see if you can't make this charisma injection thing. Uh, we should also be able to make ourselves that chem station. Ooh. Hello. We should also be able to make ourselves that chem station now because we uh, finally found a chem station. So yeah, at least at least one good thing came out of that just now. Although it still sucks that we lost our two companions just now. As before, I could even name them. I didn't even see what their names were. If they were also black magics or if they had their own names. Okay, so on the way back, I just realized there's a, an airdrop over here. To make sure I don't lose this panther now to enemies, I'm just going to do this. And jump back on. I need to actually see if I can't drink some vitamins and some proper water. I wanted to save like my proper, proper water. 
um, for when we go mining in the desert. But since we haven't found the desert yet, I'm busy losing water like crazy right now. So I'm going to have to pop a vitamin. Uh, hopefully there's no enemies where we're going to right now. As soon as I can pop this vitamin, we can just stack up in a little bit of water. And then that should tide us over until we find the desert. Okay, I just went the long way around. Yeah, I went the long way around to see where this uh, mountain range ends because I wanted to come for this airdrop. And I verified there's a waste, uh, wasteland over there. So since that's wasteland and that's uh, snow, that should be desert on the bottom right. I'm hoping. Oh, that spider's fast. We might have a problem right now. I don't want... Oh, they're attacking that. Okay, so if I can stop next to it quickly. I'm encumbered right now. That's a problem. Ooh, okay, that was close. Okay, so yeah, uh, let's go back to the base first. Uh, the base is over there. Okay, we'll quickly go back to the base first. I want to see if we can't make ourselves some charisma shots and stuff. Just test that out a little bit. Um, unfortunately, we haven't come across any cornmeal yet. I could have sworn we had corn plants or cor uh, corn. Um, but yeah, I must be mixing up my mods because I don't see it. What's that? Wait, that's oil shale, isn't it? You don't have to go to the desert. That is awesome. You don't have to go to the desert, so... The problem is I'm a little bit encumbered, so I'm going to have to drop stuff. I want to see what I looted, but I'll uh, check it out when we get to the base. Is a zombie close by? Yep, hello. See, and I can now actually drink a... Oh, but I already popped the vitamins and... Uh, yeah, vitamins and the water. Although, you know, I'm still going to do this. And do this, because we're going to get more from this. 140% more mining. I wonder if it's damage, or like resources obtained from mining. Because we needed like 1,500 from each, right? And this is definitely not going to give me enough. I wonder if I mine down here. Is it going to be more oil shale, or is it just the top of here? Nah, just the top. That is a crying shame. At least I have some stamina right now going for me too, so that's okay. You be careful of the zombies in the area, and then we just have to get as much uh, of this as possible. I think we might have, Yeah, we have oil shale at the, uh, the base as well. Remember, I wanted to make oil shale. Uh, um, I wanted to make gas with the oil shale we had, but we didn't have the chem station. So I'm hoping we have quite a bit of oil shale at the base. Hello, my lady. Hello, my darling. Bye-bye. Ooh, okay, you are a little tougher than I thought. Probably hit my panther help, but I'm just afraid that's gonna attract too much attention. If it attacks anything and everything that comes to me right now... Ooh, there's fuel over there. If I hear footsteps behind me, every time I hear the footsteps, I'm like, Ooh, zombie. See, just now, the panther would have been able to take its head off. It seems it doesn't attack the panther. Yeah, it doesn't attack the panther um, when the panther is not attacking it, so that's awesome. That means we don't have to worry about losing our panthers when we tell them to wait. Come on, I just need 1,500. I have no idea how much oil shell I have at the base. And the problem is my keyboard is underneath my mic, so typing is a little, a little bit difficult. Unfortunately, it seems that is it. My leg is busted. At least if you hold down shift, you should be able to run for a while. Um, seems there's another one over here. I wonder if there's going to be more oil shell over here. There should be, right? And now a spider source as well, so I'm going to have to let my... Oh, oil shell, oil shell. I'm definitely going to have to tell my panther to keep attacking as well. So, uh, shift, comma. Resume. Resume. Let me be careful, this thing's a brute, so it might be able to damage my poor lost panther. Okay, yeah, if I can do this, we might be able to get enough oil shale. I think I'm gonna try and get to until we get to like a thousand. Crap, that scared the crap out of me. If I can just get a thousand, I think I should have enough at the base as well. I can't remember. I definitely have a few hundred because I was like, ooh, we'll be set for fuel. Only problem is there's not a thousand left. I think there's only like four uh, strands over here. 
Okay, now that we're finally back at the base, I just have to let my leg heal. I'm hoping the panther teleports up here soon so I can tell it to stay. To a halt. No, no, don't do that. What are you attacking now? I can't afford for it to die right now. Come on, don't miss, don't miss, don't miss, don't miss, don't miss, don't miss. I told you last episode I was killing a ton of zombies with Molotovs, and they did a ton of damage to my base as well. As I was taking them down, unfortunately. Okay. Halt. So you're still gonna follow me, but you're not gonna attack anyone. I can't afford to jump too much, dude, so please don't make me jump too much. I'm just hoping it teleports up here with me soon, because I can't- I need to jump on the containers over here for it to be up here with me. Okay, so now we can make a chem station. Uh, yeah, we need steel, wooden planks, oh, broken glass. We don't have enough broken glass. Haha, <laughs> hello, black magic. Okay, guys, we don't have the Unpanthus, Unpanth so I feel it's just fair that I give myself back. Some of you might- no, you know what, let's vote on it. You saw that the two black magics uh, disappeared. Let me know, was there a notification that they died? Because it's as, as I told them to stay where they're standing, they disappeared, right? So if you say, yes, um, it's just fair to spawn two back in, I'll do it. If not, we'll just keep the one. Because now we know we're not, we, you can't do this. If you do this or this, they disappear for some reason. And I have no idea why. I wonder what come with me is. Oh, that's big up. Okay. Okay, so I wonder how many people actually said in the comments, that's pick up, dude. <laughs> okay, we need to get a POI where we can get some broken glass. Hmm. You can't make broken glass, right? And we don't have anything that we can scrap for broken glass. Glass. Oh, you can make broken glass. Oh, that's awesome. That is awesome. We just need six more. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes. Okay, now what is this? More armor, that might be better than what we have right now, and more shotgun ammo. I just love the fact that it turns itself off when something's done crafting. You don't have to worry about wasting resources. Yes! Now we don't even have- uh, we don't even need- Oh. I think this allows you to mind control zombies, right? Rotting flesh. Okay, but there, yeah, guys, there's still so much that we need to do. Okay, so let's just see. This one is weaker than what we have. This one is better, but it has less mod slots. Yeah, the other one we have on is four mod slots, but it's the armor's better on this one. This one, ooh. Yeah, we're losing mod slots right now. You're basically looking for all green. It has to have the same the same amount of mod slots and then more, uh, more protection. Or more protection and more mod slots. But unfortunately, that's a little bit tough to find. And since you can't scrap these, oh, well, you could sell them, but it's only for like 16. You can just drop them. Uh, this we can sell, yeah, 22, not worth it. Some of you might disagree, uh, disagree with me, guys, but I, I feel like that's fair. Okay, so, um... Charisma. Better barter. See, we can now make... No, that's a perk. Oh, wait, we have perk books. Better barter, charismatic nature, or... Let's go for charismatic nature. What is this? Please note that your charisma level must be higher than your uh, skill in charismatic, uh, charismatic nature. Yeah, we have zero, zero, so that's fine. Or rather, no, charisma is level one, so it is definitely higher. Um, I wonder if this is what you need to be able to talk to it, uh, to the NPCs, though. Oh, Charisma Injection, there you go. That's what I wanted to do. And then also, Daring Adventure, we need to uh, see if we can't start doing, going for this one over here. DNA Boost. Craft, wait, what's the difference right now? What's a DNA Boost? We'll see. Okay, and then, yeah, I want to go for Daring Adventure. Since our, we can't do another one because uh, unfortunately it's going to say that our charis charisma isn't high enough. Our charisma has to be level 2 for us to read another one of these. So for now, let's go for better barter. I'm just hoping we don't need the other one to be able to talk to uh, zombies and stuff. Charisma. I wonder if this is going to increase. Let's just check our charisma down here. If I go and I use this. Charisma is still level 1. What does this do? Injects will boost your charisma, but how much? Soldier. It doesn't show what my charisma is right now. Charisma is only down here. It would be cool if I could actually see what level my charisma... Oh, it's over here. Uh, charisma, 18.8%. I might be wasting these right now, but let's see. 18.8%. Oh, 
Okay, it definitely lifts your charisma. Nice, but like 18%. So now our charisma is definitely over there, which means now we can go for better barter and steering adventure. We can now read those. Your charisma level is too low. How is that possible? My charisma level is level 1. Does it need to be level 2 before we can read them? Daring Adventurer is 0. It says over here, please note that your uh, uh, base charisma level, which is this, this level 1, must be higher than the skill in Daring Adventurer, which is level 0. So it is definitely higher. Let me know if I'm doing something wrong, guys. But I feel like... Yeah, uh, either I'm misunderstanding something or it has to be level 2. It has to be level 2 for you to be able to get level 1. So I thought because my charisma is level 1, I might be able to get Daring Adventure level 1. But I think my charisma needs to be level 2 for Daring Adventure to be level 1. If that is the case, let me know down below whether I actually have this right or wrong. Yeah, it's, there's so much that I still need to learn. <laughs> okay, for now we'll just put this away. This, I think we're going to make something with it. Yeah, so we'll keep that for now. I do have a trader box over here that we can actually go and sell stuff. But even this I think you can use to craft stuff. Yep. Okay, so yeah, we must not sell all of these uh, precious ores, even though you can get more cash and stuff for them. This one... Oh, that only goes on a bow. That's an arrow rest. A crossbow basically already has a built-in arrow rest. And then for DNA injector, I'm just going to go and do this. So we need to find more of the... Oh, wait. <laughs> Hello. I'll be able to work on all of these now. So all I have to do is do this. Do this. A and W. As I'm using shortcut keys for those of you wondering. So instead of clicking here, recipes, this, and craft, I use the shortcut keys. It's way faster. So use, use, uh, this one, intelligence. This is awesome. Okay, now I know how to use this. So this is how you get your charisma and stuff up. And the higher, or the faster we get this higher, the better. We need this as high as possible. Okay, well, I might be able to sell this because I don't need it. Although technically, we might need, <laughs> we need, might need a bicycle later if we run out of fuel. Although the chem station should be done soon. Yep, there you go. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna put it on the outside for now because we don't really have the space. I need to be careful of vomiters and stuff though. Anything that can start a fire. See, we need a little bit more oil shells. So I'm, I'm not gonna do this now. Even though we do need the fuel, I'm not gonna do this now because we need like 300 and something oil shell and then we can do it. I'm gonna finish this quest. Even though it's gonna give me a recipe of some... Yeah, you know what? What does it exactly give you? What's the reward? Just 3000 XP and a uh, chemistry sc uh, station schematic, but now we have the chemistry station. So I'm going to make myself the fuel. It might be dumb after we worked so hard, but hey. 2000, oh, only that much. I'm definitely going to still have to find myself the, uh, the desert and go mine over there. Oh, I think they just destroyed another box. Another block, I mean. Do this. All mods. Ores. They're breaking all my blocks down below. I need to be careful. I need to make sure every time they destroy these blocks, I replace the blocks. Oh, there was a feral down here. I didn't even realize. This dude over here is feral. Feral Charlotte. Oh, oopsie. Ooh. Ooh. I love the reach in this. On my Apocalypse Now uh, Patreon and member server, the zombies have insane reach, so I had to go and install a shorter reach uh, modlet. But over here, the zombies are in your face, although this isn't a server, so there's no ping or anything. No lag. But yeah, it's awesome that they are so up in your face and they can still miss. Okay, I want to do this. We have fuel on us as well, so that's nice. We can actually fill up a bike. So the nice thing is uh, we are making more fuel, but we don't have to worry at the moment about fuel at, at all. Um, I should probably get myself another... I want, I want that so badly. The cash in that. Yeah, and let's quickly see if we can't find the desert. I'm first going to go to the trader and see if we can't get another um, golden rod tea because it's 140% mining. So we want to get as much out of the mining as possible. We could potentially make... Yeah, we can make ourselves some golden rod, but we need distilled water. Did I use up all my distilled waters? How do you make activated charcoal? Activated charcoal, we make it in that thing. Ground charcoal. Okay, how do you make ground charcoal? You need actual charcoal. <laughs> how do you get charcoal? Wood, tree branch. Okay, so we can actually waste all of this stuff. That doesn't matter. So we need charcoal to make ground charcoal, to make activated charcoal, to be able to make ourselves... Oh, wow. You actually need boiled water, uh, calcium chloride, and ground charcoal to make activated charcoal, to be able to then go and use another boiled water 
to make yourself distilled water. That is expensive. But the Panthers in our in us right now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, yeah, we're gonna put the Panther down anyways. Okay, so now, yeah, let's quickly go to the trader first. I want to sell a few things. I'm hiccuping like crazy. How do you repair these again? Okay, you need short iron pipes for this one. And then you need duct tape for these ones, right? Oh, something on me just now, I realize, um, needed, uh, needed nails. I should probably see, uh, see what other quests and stuff I still have to do. I've been so stuck on just playing the game and learning the game that I haven't really been checking out all the quests and stuff. There might be something that I'm not aware of that I didn't really pay attention to. Come on. I need a golden rod so we can get more oil shell if we get uh, come across some more oil shell. So guys, this was a sad episode. <laughs> Losing two of our companions, and they're brand new companions. If I knew come with me was pick them up, I would have picked them up immediately. Spared myself the sadness. Oh, you only open up at six, so it's all in-game hour still. And I can't even sell to him until then. So you can hand in quests in this time, but you can't accept new quests. Did I leave anything over here? Let's just quickly really check. It was definitely a forge over here. Okay, I didn't leave anything over there. I want to make sure because sometimes I craft stuff. Because I know the trader can craft for me. And then I leave stuff over here. Yeah, with the chem station right there, I could have used that chem I keep forgetting the trader has full-on working workstations. I want to see if the trader doesn't have sell the activated charcoal and stuff. That would save us so much time and effort. And also soon we're going to have zombies clever enough to open up doors, so we have to be careful. I'm back at six. Okay, the mercenary level... Oh, this requires what repair kit? The weapon repair kits. But I don't know if it's going to be worth selling. It's only 96 and there. Um, which one's better? This one. Yeah, unfortunately, I could use a weapon. Yeah, let's just use a weapon repair kit. I haven't been using them that much anyways. I can always buy more firearm repair kits from these over here. Oh, I need a ratchet from the trader. So what are we going to look for now? Uh, activated charcoal. The ratchet. Let me just heal myself as well. Um, And then golden rod. I'm just hoping he has some of that stuff. And then also the gold I should probably keep because that's also going to be in a recipe, right? Yep. I need to make myself an axe, but so far I haven't seen any axes that I can craft. I mean, we finally have a katana, but I, I, the katana isn't the soldier weapon. I think it's probably going to be either the butcher or the berserker that uses the katana. Unfortunately. There's a ton of zombies coming for us as well, so I have to be careful of that. Oh, I could use a Molotov, but I don't want to waste them. We only have 22 left, and if we come across any more, like, badass bosses and stuff, we'll have to use them. Come on, trader, please. Uh, next time I actually want to try the mercenary. I keep forgetting about the mercenaries. Now that it's tier 2, I want to see if they have a gun or something. Okay, so, sell, 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 yes. I should probably be using uh, the knife to skin animals, but I mean, I have the axes, it's faster. I know it's not the same thing, but at least... Okay, so, uh, charcoal. No. Uh, goldenrod? No. And then I've already forgotten what the other thing was. Uh, what was I looking for again? I'll see it when I see it. Uh, if it's not here, then I know uh, it's not, I wasn't here. I don't know why I forget stuff that easily. <laughs> I just said it's a goldenrod, the activated stuff, and then something else. Man, when my brain uh, short circuits like that, I hate it. Um, it seems as he has nothing of here that we really need right now, unfortunately. So there was no point in coming to him of here. Oh, I wanted to see if he has any uh, resources, any oil shale. Okay, guys, I'm just gonna go drop this at the base then. Uh, next episode we can. Oh, there was another event starting. Next episode we can go to the desert. I just need to find it. I'm guessing it's down there, but I don't want to take any chances. I could go over here, but I only have one panther left. So if this panther dies, I'm going to be so sad. We've already established this is the edge of the map. This is the edge of the map. And there's a wasteland over there. So it could... Uh, it could have, it could be here in the corner over here. So we'll see. If it's, not, if it's not in this corner, it has to be in this corner over here. At least now we have the fuel to go check it out. So yeah. Oh, event. So that's going to be next episode. So if you guys liked this episode, please like it to your friends, comments, tips, and feedback. Leave them below. And if you guys are new to this channel, please remember to hit the subscribe button for more of this content. 
See you guys next time for some more Rebirth fun. Once again, a huge thank you to all my members, patrons, and contributors for your support. To join them in supporting the channel, please click the join button or check out the links in the description down below.